Skills here. Today we're going to go over, we're going to review uh, Mission Impossible Dead Reckoning Part 1. So, the Mission Impossible franchise has been around since I was a kid. Uh, I've loved almost every installment of it. Like, it's just gotten better and better, in my opinion, as the years go by. And I think it is one of the best, if not the best, franchises still alive today. Like, all the other franchises, that were, like Harry Potter was like up there, but it's dead now. Um, what, James Bond? I think it's it's dead now. It, this is like the one that's still alive. Even the Indiana Jones franchise just recently. Again, not as high as its high highs. This one's still up there with its high highs. So let's go. Um, story. Great story. It would not work, I don't think, in another, like, action movie. Because it's, like, kind of ridiculous. The things that happen uh, and, and the story, like, of what's happening. What's the bad guy. But it's believable somewhat, you know. I still think I'm holding out hope, you know, that it's, it's something else. But for the movie, it, it is believable. The plot, the premise, and all the things that are happening is some. It, it, it's it's awesome. It's fucking awesome. Uh, sound design and score really good. Still the punchy dun 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 dun. That shit still works. It still hits. So yeah, sound design score good. Cinematography really really good. Like there are vistas in this movie. I did not expect to see that. I was just like, wow, this looks fucking beautiful. Um, what else? Acting, top notch. Uh, Tom Cruise, again, man might not have that great of a track record in real life, but on the movies, this man is killing it always. Like, I have not had a bad experience watching a Tom Cruise movie in a long, long time. Uh, he delivers every time. All the other people in it, obviously Simon Pegg, Ving Rhames returns, a bunch of others. Uh, that girl from Captain America, the, the Captain America girl, um, just great. Just fuck, just great. Everybody in the movie's great. The bad guy's great. The good guys are great. Everybody's great. Um, standout, though, I gotta say, is the, she's from Guardians of the Galaxy, the, the antenna girl. She's in this. Really stand, like, I really, like, I really liked her um, character in this, and I hope they bring her back for another one. Directing. Really good. I, I think the same director that did this one did the last one or the last couple of ones. He's been really good. I, I'm going to say him and Tom Cruise, they make a perfect team because this movie is, again, almost three hours long. Uh, there are there are parts that I would cut. I'm not going to I'm not gonna say it was perfectly, like the runtime was perfect. There are parts that I would still cut. Um, it wasn't like as fast paced as I'd liked it to be. But it was all right. It was pretty good. I'm not going to say that it was bad. It was pretty It was pretty good. It was actually pretty amazing. So, um, yeah, uh, check it out if you want. Uh, oh, right, what I would give it. Uh, so I'm going to say, um, I would say four out of five. Four out of five. I, I give it a four out of five stars. It's really good. I would check it out. It's out, I think, this week. It just came out. And it's literally... One of the greatest action movies I've seen this year. All right, up there, it's up there with Extraction Two. And if you've seen Extraction Two, well, I'm gonna review that. But that's on Netflix, and you should watch that if you haven't as well. But this movie, great. Um, it's in theaters now. I'm not sure. I think it's on Paramount, so it'll be on Paramount again in a couple months once it goes to like the pay window. I, I think they still do it. Like they take it to, you have to pay for it, then it'll go to Paramount Plus. So in like two or three months, it'll be on Paramount Plus. Uh, but right now. You know, seeing it's in the big screen is where it's at for this movie. I'm telling you 100%. There's a train sequence in this you're not going to want to miss. And it reminds me a lot of, like, Uncharted. If you guys ever played the Uncharted video game, the first one, it reminds me a lot of that. Anyway, um, that's been uh, the ratings, 4 out of 5. It's pretty good. Go check it out. This has been a useless skill. See you guys later.